Bold Eagle versus Golden Eagle. This is a battle of two agile and powerful raptors. Let's do it. I am Mario and this is Animal Battle. So as always, the six characteristics that we are going to compare our two candidates on are agility, attack, defense, intelligence, bone skill and survival. And after that, you'll cast your votes in the comments to choose the winner. But this time their agility stats are going to be different, since it wouldn't be fair to compare flying birds with other terrestrial or aquatic animals from previous Animal Battle episodes. Before we go straight to their agility stats, me and Spike would really appreciate it if you smash the subscribe button, since we are so close to reaching 30,000 subscribers at the time this video is released. Time to go to the first characteristic, agility. So these two birds of prey are incredible when it comes to flight. The bold eagle can reach speeds of up to 70 km per hour when gliding and up to 160 km per hour during a dive. That is already impressive, but the golden eagle overshadows the bold eagle's speed, being able to reach up to 190 km per hour when gliding. When stooping or diving, the gold eagle will hold its leg up against its tail and its wings tight against its body to be more aerodynamic. In this way, it can reach 240 to 320 km per hour, making it the second fastest bird or even animal in the world, after the peregrine falcon, of course. Still, if we were to compare their horizontal speeds only, the golden eagle would be faster than the peregrine falcon. That being said, the bold eagle is still more maneuverable in flight than the golden eagle. Also, because flying requires a huge amount of energy, especially for these big raptors, they try to save it using thermal convection currents to ascend with less effort. Now we shall see their agility stats. It is no surprise that they are doing so well when it comes to agility, even after raising the bar higher than normal. And, of course, the Golden Eagle takes the lead due to its incredible speed. Now we are moving on to bonus skills. And their bonus skills are more or less related to their eyes. Both the Bold Eagle and the Golden Eagle have an incredible vision, which is crucial for spotting prey. Their vision is actually 4 to 5 times better than our own. With a 340 degree field of vision and two separate focus points, they even see more at once than we can. Oh yes, add to that the fact that they can see ultraviolet light, which is outside our spectrum of visible light, and the fact that they can even see prey that is camouflaged or swimming underwater. With all these bonus skills, these eagles can spot a rabbit from 3 km away and an ant from the height of a 10-story building. Also, to keep their eyes moist all the time but still be able to see, these eagles have a nictitating membrane, which is basically another transparent eyelid. This grants them the ability to keep their eyes on the target without interruption while chasing it. By the way, if you've enjoyed this video so far, give it a thumbs up, and if you really hate it, you can give it a thumbs down. Either way, the YouTube algorithm will consider this feedback as more audience interaction and will show it to more people, so we can see their bone skill stats now. They are pretty good and they will need these bone skills for the next part. What is next? But of course, the attack and defense stats. As in most raptor species, sexual dimorphism can be observed in these two eagle species too, females being about 25% larger than males. The bald eagle can weigh up to 6.3 kg and reach a length of up to 102 cm. Their wingspan is impressive, being up to 2.3 meters. The size of a golden eagle is comparable to that of a bald eagle. Female golden eagles reach 5.1 kg on average, up to 102 cm in length, and have a wingspan of up to 2.34 meters. These large birds must have a big appetite too, right? What would you like to order, gentlemen? Mr. Bald Eagle, are you going to have your usual fish or would you like some birds like a goshawk, peregrine falcon, osprey or some mammals like a hare, raccoon or beaver? The Bald Eagle has a varied diet of up to 400 different species, but this time it will go for the usual fish. Once the target has been detected, it will swoop down over the water and snatch the fish out of the water with its sharp talons. Its hind talon is actually the largest one and is used to pierce the vital parts of a prey. The bald eagle can also carry prey of the same weight. Sometimes though, if a fish is too big to just fly with it out of the water, the bald eagle will swim to the shore carrying the fish. What is interesting is that sometimes a pair of bald eagles can cooperate while hunting. 
one will distract the prey, while the other surprises it coming from the pack. The bald eagle will also go for carrion if it is available. When eating its well-deserved meal, it can also store up to 1 kilogram of food in a pouch in the throat, called a crop. What about you, Mr. Golden Eagle? May I recommend a hare, marmot, ground squirrel, marten, fox, or are you that hungry that you'd go for a deer? Once the gold eagles pass the target, it will begin its dive. If the prey has nowhere to hide, it doesn't have any chance of escaping from a fast golden eagle. The eagle will use its agility and speed to catch up to the prey and its really powerful grip combined with its long sharp talons, which are one centimeter longer than those of the bald eagle, to kill the prey instantly. It also has a powerful beak that will easily rip off pieces of meat, an important ability for any raptor. When it comes to defense, these two eagles have no natural predators once they are big enough and are considered apex predators. That's if they are being smart and stay away from the ground as much as possible, because large land predators like wolverines or bears can still overpower them. These raptors are also territorial, and fights between the bald eagle and the golden eagle have been observed where their ranges overlap. As for who would win such a fight, really depends on the individuals involved. Let's see their attack and defense stats. They have really high stats, as expected from such large raptors. Next, we will take a look at their intelligence stats. Like other raptors, these two birds are really smart, because they need it for hunting. Their high intelligence has been demonstrated when bald eagles hunt in pairs, and when golden eagles knock off prey off cliffs, using gravity to their advantage. So their intelligence stats are... Pretty nice. And lastly, let's take a look at their survival stats. These eagles are doing well here, both being listed as least concerned species. An estimated number of 150,000 bald eagles can be found all across North America. The golden eagle can be found all across the Northern Hemisphere, being spotted in Eurasia, North America and the North of Africa, and having an estimated population of 100 to 200,000 individuals. The bald eagle will build a huge nest, where it will lay one to three eggs at once. The hatchlings will have an average lifespan of 20 years. The oldest wild bald eagle recorded lived 38 years. The golden eagle will lay up to 4 eggs at once, and the hatchlings will have an average lifespan of 13 years, although the oldest one recorded lived 32 years in the wild. In captivity, both birds can get to an even older age. Let's see their final stats. These two birds of prey have really good stats across all six categories. But which of them is the winner? This is all up to you because you can cast your votes in the comments by writing hashtag bold to vote for a bald eagle or hashtag golden to vote for a golden eagle. Speaking of votes, it is time to see who is the winner of the last animal battle between the Komodo dragon and the black caiman. This time it was really close. But after counting all your votes, the winner is... The Black Cayman, a powerful reptile and an apex predator. If you wanted the Komodo dragon to win, don't be upset, because here, when I'm from animals, we love and respect all animals. Once again, don't forget to cast your votes in the comments writing hashtag bold or hashtag golden. I'd also like to thank my patrons for supporting me all this time, and if you really love what I'm doing, you can also support me on Patreon to fill up that list with your name. Respect animals.